All right, today we're gonna learn how to paint this tornado on a field of some kind of crop, soybeans, I don't know. <laughs> All right, the question of the day is, how did the tornado warning system come into effect? All right, let's run through the colors. Queen red, poly red dark, phthalo blue, queen blue, Indian yellow, primary yellow, phthalo green, fur number, bandite brown, Mars black, titanium white. All right, today we're gonna to do a tornado. We're gonna have kind of these cornfields going to uh, <coughs> the middle here, which will draw a lot of good compositional rules, as well as we're kind of following this, um, we're breaking this down so we have the tornado here, or kind of vast clouds, and you're gonna have this kind of Clear front going through here where you have the storm front going that way so you have this kind of mix which gives you the reason why there's a tornado to kind of fill in this green it's kind of this weird super green green from phthalo green so i need to calm that down and start layering in kind of the different rows of um, food growing and kind of add those streaks in there and then add the lights on top of that so we'll probably just leave this as kind of the base color and then add some dark rows and then add some highlights on top of that um, here we need to lighten this up this has to be really light it's more like a sunset tornado so it's going to be really pretty around here um, I'm pretty satisfied with how this looks. Need to just tighten it up a little bit more, uh, make some more blends. It's kind of feeling like a tornado already, so I think we're pretty much there. And um, yeah, that's my idea. I might add like a counterpoint here, but I don't, know, I don't think I need it per se. <laughs>
1948, there was a severe tornado coming and the US base got notification at the last second. And so basically they weren't able to get all their aircraft into the hangar. And so they had $10 million in damage. Um, the guy that was in charge of the weather, he was acquitted, considered as an act of God. And, but at this point, the government kind of kicked into action and started developing a tornado warning system. However, when it came out, um, businessmen lobbied the national forecast system to only call it severe storms and not call it tornadoes because they were fearful that people would not invest in the area <laughs> if they knew there was tornadoes in the area, which is very common in Oklahoma, Texas area, Northern Texas especially. So they're kind of diluting the public, even though anyone living there knows there's a lot of tornadoes, but uh, it led to a lot of um, unnecessary acts and deaths, you know, because businesses and state government kind of wanted to um, <clears throat> not advertise that they had tornadoes. So that's the beginning of the US tornado warning system. All right, we just finished the painting. Let's take a closer look. This is kind of a turquoise clouds. Um, I could refine it a little more, but I kind of like that rough look. And it had this really nice golden kind of sunset coming in. And then it had these kind of green. Um, I made up the rows. There was only two rows, but I decided to do all the, you know, multiple rows to kind of <clears throat> get that nice focal point right at the, right towards the tornado. And the tornado is obviously kind of an S curve. So I got paint up here. Good thing to know. <laughs> so I have paint up here. Um, so yeah, I kind of browned out the corners. It has kind of a dark to light, really nice blend here. Um, yeah, overall, I think it's pretty well. It's probably one of the better uh, tornado ones I've done. And you know, the funnel isn't quite believable at the top. It's a little bit rough, uh, but I kept painting it over and over and it just wasn't getting anywhere. So I said, you know, it looks like a tornado for the most part. <laughs> So I just left it. Um, hopefully you guys like it. Give me a thumbs up. If you want to subscribe, you can subscribe below. And I'll see you in the next painting video. Thanks for watching, guys.